I'm going to show you a functional, like a, a person moving mechanism. It's a little weird, but I just use this big gear up here. If you I just remove the person, it has to be these cylinders that are one by ones, which is a brick tall. That means it can go around corners more easily. Also, I recommend you leaving one or two said gap in between everything. It's a little tricky doing it one handed. One second. I, f I put this character back on. And sorry for that little clip, I couldn't do it one handed that easily. And this can move based on actually going inside here. Going along, then I am used to bubble gears that can go this way, it can go upwards too. So once you turn it this way, it goes up, also turning the direction. Also turning the direction. And other than that, it, it, this is basically the it. And you can look, there's a bit of the atlas sticking up, that means I haven't perfected the design just yet. Depending on how many views this get, I might get another part to this. I can start doing this with all of my videos now. This is what to see what people is interested in. And on that, today's been episode of Sponge Structures, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.